Good evening, people. Hello. Hello, teachers. Good evening. Hello, Good evening. Hello. Good evening. Good evening. How was your day, guys? How was your day? Good. Hello, oh, teacher. Bye -bye. So good. Very, very good. <sighs> very good. Okay. What about your weekend? How was your weekend? What did you do? Your weekend, guys. Your weekend. How was your weekend? I am fine, teacher. Okay, Elfie. And your weekend? How was your weekend? El fin de semana. How was your weekend? I work in the weekend, but I I go very fine. I I am working. Okay, so you work during the weekend. Also Sunday? Francisco? Yeah, uh, Friday, Sunday, uh, all weekend. Wow, you are a hardworking person. <laughs> nah, it's, it's so good. And when is your day off? What? When is your day off? Um, I don't have a specific day for I I work. Um, in the in the and this month this <clears throat> week maybe Friday to uh, Wednesday. Ah, interesting. Okay. Well, guys, welcome to your class. This is the class number five. Yes, the second week. And let me show you the activities I have prepared for you. The topic for this class is continuous vocabulary and giving advice. Giving advice and continuous vocabulary. So in this session, you will listen to vocabulary related to containers following this part, a conversation between a pharmacist and a customer will take place. More advice for requests <clears throat> and suggestions are in so today we're going to learn how to use the modal can, could, and may. This is the agenda. We have a recording previous knowledge, and give it advice, conversation time, and wrap. So before we start, I need to take the agenda. So please say present over here. I have an announcement. There's someone here who wants to be in the class, who wants to be the teacher. She wants to be the teacher this evening. <laughs> Say hello, please. <laughs> she wants to be the teacher, but not. Qué lindo. What is your name, Kat? It's a girl. Yeah, yeah, she went away. But its name is Osita. Exactly. Okay, beautiful name. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, she, she's shy. She just went away. <laughs> okay, so please say present over here when I mention your name. The first person in the list is Ana Marisol Zamora Castillo. Ana Marisol? Present teacher. Thank you, Ana. Ana Patricia Garcia. I am here, teacher, present. Juana, Benjamin Alejandro. I think he's just oyente, right? Listener, Benjamin. <clears throat> Brenda Adriana Mendez. Present, Miss. Thank you, Brenda. Eh, Brenda Isabel Castro. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Present, Brenda. teacher. Thank you, Brenda. Okay, uh, Brian Steve Roda. Present teacher. Brian, Claudia Isa Lopez. Present teacher. Okay, Claudia. Daniela Magali Asensio. Daniela Magali. Daniela Magali. I don't see her. Okay. Edgar Fernando Portillo. 
Elisa Arely López. Presente, chef. Thank you, Elisa. Elsie Patricia de Jesús. I am here. Thank you, Elsie. Francisco Alexander Villafuerte. Present. <laughs> Griselda Moreno de Bonilla. Present teacher. Thank you, Liz. Are you sick? Are you sick, Griselda? Hello? Are you sick? Mm, no lo entiendo que estoy qué. Sick. Si estás terminando. Si, eh, sorry, si, y si está enferma. <laughs> ah, sí, sí, te estoy así desde el fin de semana. Ooh. Desde el viernes. Oh, you have a sore throat. Okay. Hope you get better. Eh, Jacqueline mm. Eliana Enriquez. <clears throat> Jacqueline Enriquez. Um, Janet Carolina Rivera. Janet. Jacqueline Enriquez. Janet Carolina. Que casi no se le escucha. Y ahí es. Está... ando mal de la gripe también, también. Oh, I'm sorry for that. The good okay. thing is that the class is not in person. <laughs> en Jacqueline Liliana también está por ahí, ¿verdad? Ya tienen el pequeño. Ok. Jocelyn Natalia Mancía. Present teacher. Ok. Karen Xiomara López. Present teacher. You Karen? Good Karina Yasmin Nuila. Good evening. Present Karina Nuila. Okay. Present teacher. Carla Colocho. I'm here. Thank you. Leslie Orellana. Present. Nice. Lucy Elena Cepeda. Present teacher. Thank you. Eh, Margarita Vigail Tobías. Present teacher. ¿Qué Margarita? Martín Ernesto Estrada. Here to chair. Ok, Martín. Ja Miley Yamile Alvarenga. Present, Miss. Michelle Beatriz Díaz. Present, teacher. Michelle. Eh, Roberto Carlos Cuellar. Present, okay. teacher. Roberto. Eh, Roberto Eduardo Escamilla. Uh, present, Miss. You, Selma Peña. I'm here. And Victoria Contreras. Okay, thank you so much for being on time to the class. So as I was telling you to start the class today, you will see here vocabulary. This is about um, important vocabulary. For example, slides. A slice, we can have a slice of pizza, a slice of bread, okay? A slice of tomato, a slice, okay? We can also have a slice of cheese, okay? We have a bottle of water, a bottle of soda, a bottle of a milk, we have another example, a bottle of ketchup. Okay. Also, we have this, a spoonful of sugar, a spoonful of sugar, a spoonful of salt, a spoonful of medicine for the people who are sick. We have a bag, a bag of popcorn or a bag of tea. A bag of churritos, right? A bag of chips. Okay. Now, the next, in the next pictures, you will see more. We have a jug, a jug of lemonade, a jug of milk, a jug of horchata, right? Horchata. <laughs> a can of peas. A can of beans. We can also have a can of tuna. It's very common in our country, tuna, or a can of soda, a can of 
mushrooms, a can of corn, a jar of pickles, a jar of jam, a bucket of fish, or a bucket of chicken, like Kentucky Fried Chicken, like <laughs> bucket. Good. So, um, taking into account this vocabulary, we are going to have some online activities. Just let me go to the website, and in a moment, you will see in the screen the exercises, okay? The exercise. So let's go over the first one. You will see it in a moment. Just hold on a minute. Or a sec. <laughs> okay, so I need your participation. We'll practice the food, well, in this case, food containers. But also, I guess the, these uh, containers could be used for other things, not only food. For example, we have a carton of juice. Water, chocolate, jam, cold coffee, all of them. Okay, in this case, according to the picture, a carton of juice. Okay, a cup of coffee. 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 A box of chocolate. 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 Exactly. A jar of. Jam. Jam. jam, jam, yes, a jar of jam, a, a tin of oh, biscuit, tuna, biscuit, a tin. tuna, tuna, yeah, a tin of tuna. It's because ah. it's the other way, <laughs> and we have a bucket of. Biscuits. 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 Biscuits or cookies, a can of yeah. cocoa, yeah. cocoa. cocoa. Or, or soda, and finally a bottle of water. 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 A bottle of water. Okay. Very nice. Easy, right? A cup yeah. of, a cup of, a box of, a jar of, a tin of, a packet of. A can of and a bottle of. Very good. Excellent. Teacher, I want a question. What's your question? <laughs> and the, uh, a can of a cup um, in Spanish translated is how? A can is lata, una lata. Ah, uh, can is lata también en español. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Yeah, in English, one word can have different meanings, right? Like in Spanish, too. Okay. For example, okay, people. Now I'm going to share the second exercise. Okay, I'm going to spill, spin the wheel. And you have to tell me what it is. What is this? What is this? A tin tuna. A tuna. 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 Yes, very nice. Okay, the next. What is this? Dun, 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 dun. Cookies. Bucket. Biscuit. Cookies. Biscuit. Yeah, but you Biscuit. have to you have to you have to tell me the container. The container too. A packet of okay, a packet of cookies or a packet of biscuits. Okay. A packet. A packet of biscuits. Very nice. Next. Frutas. 
Oh. Okay, and what about this one? Um, what is this? A jar of a jam. marmalade. A mm -hmm. jar of jam or marmalade. Okay, a jar. Marmalade. Mm -hmm. Jam. Jam, <laughs> strawberry jam. Okay. And the next is what is it? Carton. A, a, a bottle of milk. milk. A carton of milk. A carton of milk. A carton of milk. Okay, next. A can of coke. A can of coke. A can of coke or a can of soda. Mm -hmm. The next is okay. What is this, guys? Uh, okay. Pasta. Okay. Pasta. Mm -hmm. Pasta. Yeah, it's pasta. But what is the container? Bucket. Yeah. It could be a bucket Back. or it could be a bag. Back. Back. A bag of pasta. Okay. A bag of pasta. A bag of coditos, right? <laughs> okay. And we have only three. And this is? A bottle of water. A bottle of water. That's water. That was easy, right? A bottle of water. And finally, and a box or a packet of chocolate. Box of chocolate. Oh, okay. It's not a box. Uh, a box? No, it's not a box. Okay. It's a... How do you say barra? Bar. It's a bar. A bar. Of... Uh, it's a bar. bar. It's a box of. It's a bar. Una barra. A bar. 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 Like a bar. A bar. A bar of chocolate. Chocolate. And the last one is what is it? A yes, a carton of orange juice. Do you want to continue practicing? Do you yes. need to practice? Okay, Charles. Yes. Give me one moment. Just one moment. We have more practice. And you learn vocabulary. Um, teacher. Yeah. Uh, teacher. Uh, I have a question. If he, uh, I try to go to the grocery he, and I need to buy something like a bottle, how can I say if I want to buy something? Yeah, we are going to learn that today in the class. You can say, "May I have a bottle of chocolate?" May I have a can of soda? Okay. Can I have uh, a carton of egg? Okay. Okay, so I need to use, uh, can I have? Exactly. Can I have? May I have? Could I have? And I need, and I need to put the, the sentence in. The, that one that, uh, like you said, enseñando. Yeah, depending on the product you want to buy or to get oh, okay. uh, also you can say um i need a, a box of chocolate uh, for example you can say, uh, I can need or can i have oh okay. for example uh for example can i have a, a can i have a, a slice of pizza exactly uh, okay okay i got it excellent Robert. Okay, so we have more vocabulary here. 
Mm. Okay, in this case, it would be a can of mm. uh, honey. Of course. Of, of coke. Of coke. Okay. Uh, a cup of tea. A cup of tea. A tea. A cup of tea. Okay. A jug of of honey mm, yeah. a jug of water a jug of a jug i'm sorry acuérdense que a jug es el pichel right a jug of water okay a jug of honey a jug of honey a jug of honey a kilo of of meat or of cheese. Yeah, here in El Salvador we don't use kilos. We use what do we use? Pounds. Pounds. Exactly. Pounds. 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 Exactly. A piece. Bread. Of bread. Bread. Of bread. Bread. And let me see a piece of, piece of chocolate. A piece of chocolate, yes. Piece of chocolate or a piece of bread. Cheese. Exactly, because we only have a piece. Okay, a carton of milk. A cup of milk. 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 A bottle of milk. 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 Okay, I could be a, a bottle of milk and a bottle of coke. Coke. Ah, that looks delicious. Okay, a bar of chocolate. Of okay, chocolate. chocolate. So now it is correct. A bar of chocolate. A glass of water. Of a glass water. of water. Okay, a bowl of sugar. Sugar. Sugar of sugar. Bowl. Okay, a slice of bread. Of bread. A slice of bread, bread. exactly. Bread. So when you want to make a sandwich, how many slices of bread do you need? Two. Two, two slices. Two slices of bread, okay, two slices of bread. And when you, pizza, when you eat pizza, how many slices of pizza do you eat? Four. Three. Four. Three. 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 Like what about <laughs> the whole pizza? <laughs> okay, a lot of bread. Exactly. Love, like, like the baguette. A lot of bread. A lot of bread. And then, uh, are we complete? A bar of bread. A packet. Okay. A packet. A packet of? Oh, chocolate. No. Tea. No. Tea a of packet tea. of tea. Un paquete de tea. A packet of tea. Fíjense que aquí en piece nos, no me había fijado que está furniture. So it's a piece of furniture. furniture. No, no sé por qué no me había fijado. A piece of furniture. Sí. Vamos a ver. Furniture. Sí, ponen. ¿Dónde, dónde? Ah, it's a piece of furniture. Una... Vale. No tiene. No tiene. No tiene. No tiene. No No tiene. No tiene. No tiene. No tiene. No tiene. Yeah, because we have all and of cheese. Them. Yeah, a piece of cheese then. 
Yeah, because furniture doesn't have, but it's a piece of furniture. It could be a piece of cheese, a kilo of cheese, <laughs> or um, a slice of cheese, it depends, right? Okay. Right. Oh. Okay, so maybe this bottle, the bottle of Coke with the bottle of water. <laughs> Okay, guys, thank you. Very good. So did you like the activity? Yes, yes I, I like. Okay, I will send you the link so you can do other exercises. Okay, in your free time because we don't have enough time in the class, but I will send them so you can practice. Okay? The other ones, these three. We did the first three. I will send you the other three so you can practice at home or at work when you had a free time. Okay. okay, so now it's gonna be easier to do this because as you can see, these are products that you can buy in the pharmacies or in the drugstore. So it's gonna be easy to complete these expressions. So help me please because I don't remember. We have a, look at the picture, what is this? A bag, bottle, box, can, jar, pack, stick, or tool. Two. This bottle. A bottle of pain medicine, right? Okay, number two. Box. A, a, a box. box. A box of ma box. bandage. Okay. Bottle. Number three. Bottle. Bag. Cough drop. A bag. A bag. Uh -huh. Okay. A bag of the other of cough drops. Bag. Okay. What is the other one? A stick. A stick. I, a stick. A I stick think because ladies be a stick. Exactly. Very nice. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. That is understanding. You are. <laughs> <laughs> okay, face cream. Two. Mm. Look at that. It's two face cream. A jar. Two. It's a jar. No. Jar. No. A tube. Mm. Okay. No, no es tubo. No es una jarra. A pack. A bottle. No es una jarra. A can. I can. I can. I can. right? I can. Or clean. Okay, what about shaving cream? Two. A bottle. No. Or a can. Okay, Bar. we have options. Can. Bar. I think can. Car. Bottle. For me. Car. Bottle. Car. Uh-huh. A jar. Okay. <laughs> oh, border, please, sir. Okay. Car. Jar. Car. Car. Okay, what about tissues? A box. A box of uh, tissues. Box. And. Yeah, or two. 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 But we already use box. It could another, another, another option for the tissues. 
could be? A pack. A packet or a pack. A pack of tissues. And finally, a tube. A tube of toothpaste. Teacher. Tube. Yes, Griselda? La número seis no sería igual un two. The shaving. Es como una pasta de dientes. But shaving, but look at this. Picture is not a shaving cream, not a tube, uh, shaving cream. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. it yeah, it depends on, on the picture here. Okay, then. okay, so again, thank you. And then presentation. <laughs> okay, um, what is or what are other things that you can buy in a bottle? What can you buy in a bottle? Medicine or everything? Anything. A bottle of beer? Oil. <laughs> a bottle of, of beer? A bottle of oil. Okay, a bottle of oil, yes. Okay, what else, what else do you buy in a box? Excuse me, can you repeat, teacher? What else? What else? What other things do you buy in a box? Tools? A box of tools. I can understand. Box of pampers. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Miley, a box of shoes. Okay. They come in a box, right? <laughs> hey, what, what do you buy in a box? We, I think Salvadorian buy most of the things in a bag. Pizza. In a bag. In the bag. Yeah. In a box? You buy the pizza in a box, right? The the chicken, they can buy a chicken in a box or don't buy a chicken <laughs> in a box, but in a bag, Mega bag. in a bag, tomatoes, potatoes, onions, right? Chicken, chips, popcorn, <clears throat> groceries, yeah, in a bag, also the snacks, right? The snacks. Like peanuts or tortillitas, right? Corn chips, they come in a bag. What about what do you buy? Ice. Oh, the ice too. Okay. What do you buy in a, on a stick? Lipstick. Oh, yeah. Lipstick. Very nice. Very nice. Okay. In a can? And soda, juice. juice. Okay, juice, tuna, eh, corn, mushroom, mushrooms, sardina, sardines. <laughs> sardines. Okay, very nice. Okay, what about jar? A jar of honey. A jar of jam, a jar of peanut butter. I love peanut butter. Okay. Mm, what do you buy in a pack? Chips. In a pack. In a pack. <laughs> cookies. Okay. A pack of cookies. A snack. Pack of snacks. A pack of Coffee. Biscuit. People, people buy a biscuit. Pack of biscuit. Okay. A pack of margarine. Pack of matches. Okay. A pack of matches. Yes. Or a box of matches. Box. Sería box. Oh, well, you buy the pack and you can buy the little box. Okay. Very nice. And two. 
Maybe creams, right? Cream. Cream for the cream. Yeah. Okay, very nice. Do you yeah. have a medicine a cabinet or a first aid kit? Yes, I think. Yeah, I have. Yeah. Yes, you do? Yes, I yes, have. I have. It's important to have a first aid kit, a botiquin, or a medicine cabinet at home, right? What does your medicine cabinet or first aid kit have? What does it have? Aspirin, okay. alcohol, acetaminophen, acetaminophen, cotton, alcohol, cotton, salandrius. <laughs> okay. Perfecto. Is, is cotton? Okay, cotton, alcohol, bandage, bandage. Okay. Maybe a pair of scissors. Okay. Nice. Very nice. Mask. Sticking places. Water oxygen. <laughs> okay. Sticking places. Para los niños. Intesto no medicina. A tube for a. Alcade. Esta medicina. Alcade. Acetamino, <laughs> ibuprofen, okay. ibuprofen, ibuprofen, intestinamicin. Teacher, sticking plaster, eso es para grapo. Yes, yes, that's right. Sticking plaster. Okay, so let's continue yeah. now with the conversation between. This conversation is between uh, the pharmacies. Okay, it says, hi, may I help you? Yes, please, could I have something for a pack? My muscles are really sore. Well, it's a good idea to use a heating pad. And why don't you try this cream? It works really well. Okay, I'll take one too. Also, my wife has a bath cup. Can you suggest anything? We should try this cough drop. Babe, may I have a large bag? And uh, what do you suggest for insomnia? Well, you can get a box of chamomile tea. Is it for you? Yes, I can't sleep. A sore bag and your wife's bad cough? I think I know why you can't sleep. <laughs> he can't sleep because he has a sore back. His wife has a back. <laughs> okay. So as you notice, he asked, can you suggest anything? Can you suggest anything? Or also you can ask what you suggest. ¿Me puede sugerir algo? ¿Qué me sugiere? O what do you recommend? Is another option. What do you recommend? So when you go to a pharmacy, you can ask, could I have, could I have something for fever? Could I have something for stomach? Could I have something for nausea or migraine? And then they give you suggestions, for example, uh, why don't you try this aspirin? Why don't you try this uh, cream? Why don't you try vitamins? Okay. So let's look more examples in the next slide. We have the model verse. For requests, para pedir algo, for requests, we use can or may or could. For example, you can say, can I help you? Or may I help you? Can I have a bag of cough drops? Could I have something for a cough? May I have a bottle of medicine? 
Okay, and um, you can use these expressions not only when you go to the pharmacy, but also when you go to the supermarket, when you go to a restaurant, anything in your life, right? You can say, for example, to make a request, can I turn down the volume of the radio? Could I um, close the door? May I open the window? May I answer my cell phone? Mm, could I um, go to the restroom? Uh, can I have a packet of chocolate or a packet of cookies? Uh, may I have, um, a, I don't know, a, a slice of pizza? Uh, could I have a can of soda? Okay, so in different situations. That's why we were learning vocabulary for containers because we asked for that, a bag of or a bottle of. Remember that there are some things that are not countable, so we need to know the container of those things, like water, right? May I drink my cup of water? No. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> okay, over here we have uh, the suggestions. You can say, you can ask, what do you suggest for, or what do you have for a packet, for filler, for a COVID? <laughs> and to give suggestions, you can say, you could try this new cream, you should get a heating pad, or why don't you try these pills? So those are ways to give suggestions. You could try, you should, and why don't you? Es, lo hace más, eh, más formal o más suave, eh, de una forma más suave. Why don't you? ¿Por qué no trata o por qué no intenta? ¿Por qué no toma esto? Okay? And remember, the grammar structure is always the modal verb at the beginning for a question. Then you have the subject, and the verb will be always in base form. When we have a modal, the verb is in base form always, and then the complex. Example, can, I, can subject, I, verb, have. And the complement, a bag of coffee. And the sentence, affirmative sentence, you know, subject, modal, and verb in base form. Can you tell me some examples, guys? Examples, please. Using can, could, and may. You can make any request in the class, in the supermarket, the gas station, in the market, in the drugstore or pharmacy, in the English class. I have a box of, of bandages. Okay. Can I have a can of soda? <laughs> Very common. Uh, may I have a, a carton? A carton of eggs. Eggs. Yeah, and eggs. they are very expensive now, right? Yes. <laughs> Another one. May I have a pound of cheese? May, mm -hmm. May I have a pound of cheese? I love cheese, so I go very often to buy cheese. Another one, could I have a pound of 
a chicken chat? Do you like chicken chat? Or chicken leg? Or chicken wing? Mm -hmm. Okay. May I have a, something, uh, wing and cheese? May I have? A something, a uh, wing and cheese? I don't get it, Francisco. Sí, podría yes. ser también, teacher. Why don't you try eat pizza? Okay. Yeah. Francisco, I didn't get what you said. Uh, may I have something uh, of wiener cheese? Without cheese. Win. Vino. Ah, okay. Wine. I am cheese. Okay, you can say, may I have a slice of cheese with wine? Like that? Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, when you try wine, then give you, right? A slice of cheese. Italian cheese. cheese. <laughs> okay, so these are the requests. Requests. What are requests? Requests, they are in form of questions because we are asking something. Cuando pedimos algo, requests, we ask. Entonces es en forma de pregunta, request. Ahora, alguien por ahí dijo la la, cómo respondería. Can I have a box of bandage? You can say, sure, right? Only that. <laughs> you can have many answers. For example, you could try this new brand, esta nueva marca brand of bandages. Um, could I have a pound of chicken chest? Sure, of course because we are asking for other things, right? But if you ask for a suggestion, what do you suggest for, uh, what do you suggest for stomach? Ache? Now let's go for suggestions. What do you suggest for stomachache? Stomach. What do you suggest for the stomachache? Medicine. Uh huh. You can say you should, you. or why don't you, or you could. Take pills. Uh, you could you, try. You could try. With you could. Okay, you could try to For take gray. pills. Or, yeah? You call drink, to drink Pepto-Ismol. Okay, you could take pep okay. or why don't you why don't you try Sal Andrews? Somebody said that that's right. Okay. What do you have for flu? What do you have for the flu? Hello. You should visit a doctor. Okay, but I'm asking, what do you have for the flu? Because you are the pharmacist. 
You should try to take video grip. Okay. Okay. Um, you should call Ambroxol. Okay, you could take Ambroxol. Okay. And why don't you Uh -huh. Take a chamomile tea. Okay, very nice. Very nice. Excellent. Okay. In the next slide, I was um. It was um an activity in groups, but we don't have much time to do it. So let's see, how can we do it? Let me see. Ah, okay, this exercise. Choose the correct words and then compare and practice. So can or could I help you? What is the best way? Can. Can. Can I help you? Because of the car. In this case, in this case, it's a request, right? Can I help you? It's the most common way. Can I help you? Yes. Why do you suggest? So that yes, for dry suggest. skin. What do you suggest for dry skin? Okay. Why Trying do you try? Well done. You try. Why don't you try this lotion? It's excellent. Okay, I'll take it. Number two, may? May. May, may I have something for it? Exactly, may I have something for itchy eyes? Itching? Itchy eyes, right. Cuando le pican los ojos, right? Itchy eyes. Sure, you? Could try a bottle Good. of you eye drop. It's a suggestion. Oh. You could try a bottle of eye drop. Okay. Could I have? A box? Could I have a bottle of bandages? Could I have a box of bandages? Here you are. Here you are. So good. Tiene. And what do you suggest? Suggest for insomnia. You should. You should. You should try this herbal tea. It's very relaxing. Okay, thanks. Very nice. Thank you, Michelle. Very good. <laughs> now we have here the conversation type. One. We only have ten minutes, but we can do it as a class. Uh, okay. So can we have two volunteers? Imagine you are okay, a customer. Sir. Okay, I'll see. And we need another volunteer. Okay. Another. Okay, Elsie and somebody else. Okay. You are customer at a drugstore. You need something for a back, something for dry skin, something for the flu. Something for low energy, something for surface, and something for a upset stomach. Absent stomach. stomach. Thank you, Elsie. And for some suggestions, or how much pronounce Suggestions, suggestions. Suggestions. Okay. Exactly. I have the example here. May I have something for a bucket? Sure. You should try this marijuana cream. Marijuana cream. <laughs> it was just an example, okay? <laughs> but I need volunteers to role play the conversation, okay? So you start. Can I help you? Yes. May, what do you have for 
the flu. What do you have for dry skin? Or may I have something for low energy? Or for sore, sore feet? Or any other problem you have? You can also have other problems, but we need two people in the class to role play the conversation. Do we have volunteers? Try, guys. Try. Volunteers or victims? Victims. No, guys, volunteers. Or victim. A lo que se están durmiendo, lo voy a ver. Wait, aquí el primero ya vi. <laughs> no, just kidding, just kidding. Okay, volunteers. Thank you, Brian, for raising your hand. Brian Steel and Claudia Lopez. Brian and Claudia. Okay, Brian. You are the customer, and Claudia, you are the pharmacist. Okay. Um, could I have something for a package? For a package. Okay. Ah, okay. Claudia? Eh, sería student letter B. Yes, you are the pharmacy. Are, you entonces, are a pharmacy. Entonces usted, Claudia, le va a dar a Brian, le va a sugerir algo para el dolor de espalda. Ok. Um, it's a tall... It's told um it's told um is um go file. Okay, you and should try to scream. Discofal cream, for example. <laughs> okay. Discofal cream. Now, what about uh, another person? Uh, Ana Patricia, would you like with Roberto Carlos? Okay. Okay, Ana, you are the customer. Roberto is the pharmacy. Okay. Uh, may I have something for a headache uh, you you take to you can you could you could take you could you could pay uh, to pill pillora como se dice yeah pill pill yeah oh this, of what this is nice Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank Very you. Nice. Okay, people. Um, because of the time, we need to stop here, but you can do it for homework. Okay? I will send you the tips and you can do it for homework. Is that okay? I didn't yeah. understand. For I can hear. Okay. You will finish this for homework. Uh huh. Uh -huh, because we didn't have time in the class to finish. <laughs> okay. So, okay, you okay. can write a conversation. Two short conversations are okay. Okay, two problems, two suggestions. And we continue tomorrow. Okay. So, hey, can, okay, you me, can you tell me? Can you tell me? regresar what? rápidamente la pantalla. ¿Dónde estaba? Please. Ajá, y en eso, can you tell me what did you learn in this class? What did you learn in this class?
¿Aprendieron algo? Okay, people, it was a pleasure to see you this evening. Good night. 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 Good